Look at that. So that is what a 20 year old law looks like. A law that hasn't actually been used in about 20 years as well. And today we're gonna to be doing something a little bit different. Still gonna be fishing, getting some dogs on that, hopefully anyway. We're just gonna be doing a bit, a little bit of restoration and showing you how to restore some chrome laws or pretty much anything chrome. It's pretty cool. My old man showed me this when I was a bit younger and it works a bloody treat. Just run you through a few of the things we're gonna need. Obviously you need some new hooks. I'm going down a hook size as well. New rings, tin foil, aluminium foil, coke. I've been in contact with Halco about these as well. These, this is a 70 gram Halco hex. They stopped making these about 12 years ago now and the person that I got it off reckons that he hasn't used it for 20 years. So this could be like 20, 25 years old this law. It's pretty cool. So I'm looking forward to restoring this. First things first, we're just gonna get the rings off and get rid of the hook as well. Get rid of that massive hook on the bottom of that. Get that hook off first on this one, make it a little bit easier for ourselves. Old rusty hook. 70 grammer. Next up, all you need, just some foil, coke. You can use water, I think you can use water, anything really, or a bit of oil, but I have found that coke works the best. With the foil, scrunch it up, and because the foil is a lighter material than the law, or any chrome really, you can do this on chrome parts of your car as well, it will just shine it back up. It does take a while. But when you start seeing that black, that means it's doing its job. And you're seeing all the places where it starts getting the salt off of it. That's where it turns black. Just got to work it in as well, keeping it scrunched up. Just change it out every now and then. When it starts getting compact like that, you haven't really got much left on it. This could possibly be as old as I am. Huge difference in it already. Look at that. That's doing the job. Definitely doing the job. Awesome. I'd, I'd hate to rub that logo off. And then fingers crossed. <laughs> it's not a, a first flick loss. That'll be an absolute nightmare. Enough to just snap the line. But with my track record, not impossible. I was hoping it was going to come up a little bit brighter than that. But the only thing that I can think of is some stainless steel cleaner. Give that a bit of a buff. I reckon that's just about as good as we're going to get that. Halco 70 grammer. Let's get some rings on it. All right, that was difficult. That was very difficult. Hooks going on this one. Halco hex 70 grammer. Probably not seen the sea in about 20 years. Let's get down the beach and catch some bait. Yes. If you recognize it, this is the old law that I've restored. It's been in the tackle box for ages now, so it's actually gone a little bit rusty again. But we're gonna do some jigging. Do some shore jigging. Uh, nice heavy metal, so get some good casting distance on it. Just make sure we've got our feet in a good position. Absolutely bomb that out there. Wait for that slack line. She's deep. That's annoying. It's a, um, it's a jig. Now to just snap the line. And that was that, guys. That law honestly didn't get used up until that Big point. On. That's about six months later. That law just sat in my tackle box, getting unused. I changed out some assist hooks. 
had a couple of casts and then bang lost that law i'm absolutely gutted because that law was probably as old as i am i should not have flicked it off there once again though thanks again for watching massive shout out to everyone that's watched to the end don't forget to like the vid if you're new to the channel subscribe leave me a comment of what you thought and i will see you in the next one